Hello and welcome to Benor FMS. In today's video, we're going to learn how to monitor Windows processes in Benor FMS. For that, we must know that there's a parameter called module underscore PROC that checks whether a specific process is being executed in the machine. The values that you will obtain may be zero if no positive response is obtained or one if the result is true. Next, we're going to see some examples to monitor processes such as CMD or VirtualBox. The syntax is very simple, but for this we will first have to go to the agent with remote configuration enabled and create a new data server model. Once there, fill in the required information in the configuration box. The first thing is to include the opening tag module underscore begin, then indicate the name of the module. The type of data you expect to retrieve, that as indicated previously, will be boolean, since we expect to receive one or zero. So type in generic underscore PROC. You may also add optionally a tag with the description if you want to add extra information and finish the syntax with the closing tag module underscore end. Once this is finished, check that it is correctly constructed and proceed to create the model. While you wait for the agent interval to go by and the modules to return data, we will see where we can obtain the name of the processes. This is as simple as opening the task manager and going to the processes tab. Here there is a list of those available. You can copy the name for example by displaying the two results that you have under the command processor and clicking on the right button in command prompt to open properties. There you will find the name of the process that you will include when you configure the module in the label module underscore PROC and that will be as it is written here, including spaces and respecting upper and lower cases. If it had any space it will not be necessary to enter the full name in quotation marks, leave it as indicated in the task manager. Another option that you may include in the module syntax if you want the Windows software agent to notify you immediately when a process stops working is to add the parameter module underscore async yes. To analyze the difference in performance between a module with this parameter and another without it, we're going to duplicate the one we're working with to include the label in one and not in another. Next, we see that they both return 1 since the CMD is open. If you close it, we see that in a few seconds the module that contains the line module underscore async changes its state, while in the other case the change will take place when the interval of 5 minutes that is usually configured by default goes by. To finish off, we're going to see an extra feature with which we can work in this type of models. It is Watchdog. This Pandora FMS software agent feature for Windows allows you to act immediately upon a sudden process stop, starting automatically. With the extra lines that we have added in the configuration, we're indicating that every time the Notepad program stops working, the watchdog will execute the command C colon inverted slash Windows inverted slash Notepad.exe. Deactivation of the process will be attempted 5 times with an initial timeout of 3 seconds and with a timeout between retries of 2 seconds in the active user session. As we can see, if we try to close the notepad, the new model that we have generated will automatically send the order to reopen it and it will appear on the screen. If we delete the line module underscore user underscore session yes, what will happen is that the process will start but in the background, as we can see in the task manager. And that was it for today's video. Do not forget it, if you like the video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Remember that if you're interested in trying Pandora FMS Enterprise, contact us to get a free 30-day trial. Thank you very much for your time and we hope to see you in social media and in future learning videos.